Let's turn your iPhone screen black and white. Now, if you're on your iPhone and you want the entire screen, maybe even the apps to be black and white, the first thing we're gonna do is hop into your settings. The first option you have is to change it in accessibility. Now you can set everything to be black and white, including all of the menus and your photos, all of that stuff, or you can choose to just turn the app icons to be black and white. I'll show you both options. Now, the first option is we're gonna go in here and we're gonna choose color filter. Now within color filter, I can turn it on and you can see a bunch of different options and it immediately changes the color of these crayons, kind of indicating the color tint of your phone. But I can choose grayscale instead and now everything is black and white. And if I hop out of here, again, my entire iPhone is black and white. I can open up the photos and even the photos are black and white. So this might be what you want, but this might be too much black and white. You might just want the app icons to be black and white, but your colors for photos, all that stuff. So let's go back and turn color filters off. Now, another option we have is we can tap and hold somewhere that there is not an app. So I'm gonna tap and hold towards the bottom next to the boat. And then I'm gonna tap on edit and customize here. Now I can customize the look and feel of these app icons by tapping on clear. And you can see now all of the app icons are just white. Or I can tap on dark if I wanted one, all of them to have kind of a dark background. Now everything has a black and white look and feel to it. However, if I open up the Photos app, they're still colorful and in full color. Depending on your preference for black and white, you can choose which one you want.